morning to you. I can already hear your silence. I'm feeling your joy, your smile, are you? Tune back into it, into your flow of grace, your flow of abundance, which is always here flowing. You're just standing next to it with your back away from it. My voice is here to turn you towards it. Can you hear it? It could sound like rushing water. That's how some hear this divine sound stream. I hear it that way sometimes. It may sound like bells. It may sound like a flute. Rumi says to God, you are the notes and we are the flute. We are the mountain. You are the sounds coming down. We are the pawns and kings and rooks. You set out on a board. We win or we lose. We are lions rolling and unrolling on flags. Your invisible wind carries us through the world. We may not be able to see the wind, but we can see its effects. We can feel it. Sit up straight like a weather vane. And place both hands out in front of you, palms up. And feel the spiritual wind. You may experience it as a vibration on the seeming inside of those palms. You may feel it as a cool sensation on the surface of those palms, a cool that's different from the feel of an air conditioner or a fan. It's richer, it's deeper. In Acts 2, it says, and suddenly there came a sound from heaven as of a rushing mighty wind and it filled all the house where they were sitting. I often feel this holy breeze inside this whole body while seated in meditation. When I first sit down in meditation, it's noisy inside. But at some point, it gets quiet and a peace rolls in. It rolls upwards through the body. And as long as I don't analyze it or get too excited about it, there is no body. Everything that I thought was me is not me and only that peace. This breeze is me. You have but to allow me to smile through your eyes, to speak through your voice, to allow my healing force to pour through your hands. Then shall all the glory of the Father be a living fire about you. Nothing that happens in the outer realm shall penetrate that holy flame. You shall dwell as a thing set apart, even as one of the candles in the holy temple shall you be guarded. As you express the life of your being to all you meet, great floods of power shall pour into you again and you shall walk and not be weary, run and faint not. So open yourself, cleanse yourself that I, the Lord of your soul, shall manifest my glory through you, my human vessel of expression. That's Ava Bell Werber. C.S. Lewis says, relying on God has to begin all over again every day as if nothing had yet been done. You have to find this love every morning as if you've never found it before. You have to find it every moment as if you've never practiced before. Every single seeming moment, you have to hit that reset button. You have to become conscious again. You're always either unconscious or conscious, unenlightened or enlightened, not feeling love or feeling love carrying baggage or not, recognizing that there is no baggage to put down, nothing to let go of, no one to forgive, nothing to do. And yet things get done and people and situations are forgiven, but it's all happening through you by the Christ in you. Angela Celestia says it depends on you if in your heart you make a manger for his birth. And God will once again become a child on earth. Those will again become his feet that you can look down at right now. Those are his hands outstretched. That's his face smiling, remembering to smile all day. Because if you can't give anything else, you can give that. Max, my son, calls himself the smile giver, the happiness causer. He speaks to everybody. Even if they're 10 feet away on the other side of the street, 
We have to cause smiles. We have to light candles. Ours is lit. We are blessed. But with that blessing means we have to light the rest of ourselves. It's your responsibility. I would say take it seriously, but don't take anything serious. Take it lightly, but constantly. You're feeling it. I love you, and we'll chat soon. If this episode helped you feel good, helped you feel God, then leave a review on Apple Podcasts and screenshot it and send it to me for a free gift. And follow me on Patreon so I can see you, so I can see your smile.